Okay, I'm starting off in Adobe Captivate 12.2. And as you can see here, I'm on the home screen of Adobe Captivate. And you can see that there are some featured templates. We have just a few samples that we could start with, the diversity and inclusion, leadership communication, product onboarding. But if I wanted to actually open up the full list of quick start projects that are available, I need to create a new project and I can click on the new slide icon and of course go down to assets. Here I can see the full list of quick start projects that are available and that's great. So if I chose something like customer service skills, I could pick any one or more slides from this. However, I can't open the entire project as a completed project. Alternatively, I can click on the assets icon in the bottom left hand corner and select all the various slide templates that are available, scroll through any of these, or do a search for a particular type of slide. Let's say I was looking for an introduction slide. I could type in the word introduction and it would show me all the slides that meet that search parameter. But with this particular way of accessing the quick start projects, I can only insert one slide at a time. So this really doesn't help me with opening an entire quick start project. Okay, so now I've upgraded to the all new Adobe Captivate release 12.3, which you know is either happening today or it's coming real soon. And as you can see, my home screen looks a little bit different. You'll see that there's this option over here for quick start projects. So if I go ahead and click that, I now have access to all those same quick start projects we saw earlier in the video, but this time I can download them in their entirety. So if I select the customer service skills, I can actually wait for that to download and then I'll have a completed project and I can of course customize it for my own needs. There we go. So there's all the slides. This includes all the interactions, all the buttons that jump to a particular slide. You don't need to recreate those options. This is a great way if you're just getting started with Adobe Captivate and you need to build something quickly for your organization and you just wanna change some of the text, this is a, a great option for all of you.